we are live. Good evening, everybody. Welcome to Contest of Speed. We're back. We are back. It's EU3 this evening. On a Monday. Don't get too freaked out. You'll be okay. Uh, as always, I am Matt. Alongside me should be Shane, but Shane's having some technical difficulties. We join the session and... Uh, we will be your commentary crew for EU3 this season. This is because my usual partner in crime is racing, P18. At the moment, he's young squire, Mr. Daniel, um, and it should be an exciting season. It's going to be very, very even across the board, I think, in EU3, and very competitive indeed. These guys have not had pre-season. So they are jumping into it and racing with each other for the first time. So, with that all said, I have the driver lineups in front of me so you can know what's going to happen. Uh, in the McLarens, we have Mac and we have his partner J Ray. You saw these guys a lot in the U4 last season and they are in EV3 this season, worthy so. Um, a nice strong little partnership there with two championships coming their way from last season. Uh, Tynus, who we saw a bit of last year, he is in the Red Bull with Sygate. Kind of a regular here at Contest of Speed. Both, uh, I'm going to say both duck drivers, I believe. Apologies, Tynus, if I've got that wrong. Uh, we move on to Twitch Storm. So he's one of our new drivers. We saw him at the end of last year having a reserve role. Did a couple of races and he's now full time in the Alfa Romeo. And he is alongside Mr. Tebow as, uh, as the Alfa Romeo partnership. Uh, JRN joins Steve in Mercedes. Now, I would say if those two can get some races together they will be close to the front already uh, we'll move on to that person because AJ's just asked why Spud didn't crash Spud has retired in the pits because he's not qualifying Spud things don't ask why um, and Spud is going to be alongside Titchy Titchy has literally no time to practice whatsoever and the fact that he is jumping into EU3 will be very very interesting to see how the Alpine team can do this season. Um, we head over to Aston Martin where we see a dynamic duo and we see Cornish Mantis who is here this evening and Blades who isn't which is a disappointment because that would have been everyone in car that would have been here that races normally um, and Blaze is being replaced by Orlando Orlando who you see in AM3 I believe let me check that because I was okay in trouble if it's wrong uh, Orlando is in Sorry, in AM2, and he races for Aston Martin, so that is big races for Alpha Tower. On the AM scene, uh, we have Amy in the Williams, and he is partnered with no one at the moment, he's all by himself. Uh, but that seat, I think, will be filled very soon, hopefully. Uh, Twin Gene, new driver in the Haas. He is alongside Frank Nasser TGN, which I think will be a very inexperienced Haas team uh, in terms of contest of speed racing. Uh, they are an inexperienced pair. Uh, Tin Man is alongside Red Mars. That is a team to watch, I feel. That is the Alpha Tower guys. Red Mask competed a lot in AM3, uh, EU3 last year and also in the high tiers of EU2 and AM2. Um, someone to look out for. He's with the American counterpart Tin Man, who does both series. Congratulations, that man. And we're glad to have him aboard again for the European side. Uh, and then we leave perhaps to the oldest pairing. I'm going to say it. 
and they're gonna hate me, but the oldest pairing in the grid. Uh, X427 alongside two spell. There is years of wisdom and knowledge amongst those two drivers and plenty of contest of speed history as well. So that's your quick rundown of the grid, hopefully. Shane will be here soon. Who knows? We'll uh, just double check. Bear with me. See. Um, <coughs> so what I would like is uh, for the people that are here I would like your early season predictions who's going to put their neck on the line and predict who is going to be the tier champion stay with it the reason why I say neck on the line is it, it's because we have a 60 uh, we have an 18 round calendar yes you heard that right 18 rounds of action uh, we start this week, January the 23rd, uh, and then we go up to February the 27th, where we have then a week break, and another six races, and a week break, and uh, another six races, and then a week for a rerun if required. Um, all over the globe, starting Bahrain, we're going to finish in Brazil, because that's where I feel it should finish, in Brazil. It's a, it's a lovely time, um, and it shouldn't be Abu Dhabi, but I'll get tongue drawn in quarters. Just saying that now. Um, yeah, Bahrain, Canada, Cota, uh, Baku, Portugal, and Mexico, and France, Belgium, Japan, Britain, uh, Netherlands, Monza, uh, Hungary, Abu Dhabi, Imola, Singapore, China makes a return, and Brazil. So some of the tracks we've not done so far this game, and some of the tracks we have done so far this game. So it should be very exciting. Um, two Spell has put himself on pole, a 29-2. Uh, it will be an easy one stop, I think. Hard, hard, medium. Always you feeling fancy. Uh, two stop. Soft, medium, medium, and... Oh, I've just dropped my phone. Soft, medium, soft. Thank you, OJ. Uh, yeah, it's a shame, Andy, that Austria is not in the schedule, but again, there's no Monaco, so I'll tell you that. Austria, we do a lot. Austria we do, is one of the tracks we do a lot for um, special events and things like that, so I can see why it's not being used. It is a shame, because it always provides the best racing, but I think Brazil being our finale will provide a fitting end because Brazil always is a uh, a good race, league race, especially here. Oh, and of course, no Sochi because, yes. Not getting political. Uh, J Ray 28 8. It is very congested near the front of the grid. I'll see if uh, Shane is alive. Oh, I saw that before, Mr. Mantis. Yeah, Austria is always the best racing. We know, we know it is. Shame it's not on there this time around. Let's jump on board with a person that we have not seen much of. Ragnista, who has just spun, so that's not particularly very good. We'll go on board with Tebow, who doesn't normally do qualifying. It's not his thing. But hopefully this season he will do, because 
said, it should be a very competitive in this three. And if he doesn't do qualifying, I think he's going to uh, struggle. Yeah, if you've done as many races and commentary like I've Andy, then yes, I can sympathise with your, with your comment. Is there such thing as a wheel track? A pad track? Pad OP and wheel OP circuits anymore? I don't seem to hear it that much. Sorry to spam the pot through. Who is on a lap? Jaren isn't. Orlando isn't. Titchy's doing his usual. I'm going to just do a heavy fuel run and see what it's like and no practice and I'll go around and do a lap job. It's what, it's what he does. We'll be fine, Electric Bay, we'll be fine, we've gone through a lot worse. Gone through a head of a lot worse than uh, that. Yeah. I'd rather see three tiers like this with nearly pretty much a full grid than uh, four tiers where we're scrambling to get it through. There is a man that has arrived, and hopefully he's going to deliver me some good news. Who, me? Yeah, you. Hopefully you're going to deliver me some uh, good news. Nah, bro. I have no clue what's going on, so I'm just going to watch the stream. Sh Shane is going to watch the stream. Lovely, because I'm glad you can do that, Shane, because <laughs> I think I'll die by the time we get to the end. But um, we've gone through the tier lineups. So obviously, there was no pre-season last week. Because we had to get some fin final driver dealings uh, mm -hmm. across the line. We, I've just seen a very weird incident with Titch and someone else. We'll move on from that. Uh, but we have three tiers, which is which is a good sign, considering we were worried it was only going to be two tiers, which would have been disastrous. Uh, but we've got three tiers of racing, and it should be very, very good. Well, let's hope so. Let's hope so. You've got a new mic since you've last commentated, so that's even better. Yeah, yeah, no more, what was it, alien or whatever? I was, I was a lot of things back then. You, it was like a, it was like listening to a Belgian robot. <laughs> Let's say the least. Um, we've gone through, it's going to be a very close and competitive grid I feel here, because there's a lot of, we're talking, a lot of EU3 people that uh, stayed on from last season, but we're also talking about EU4 guys that were doing particularly well towards the end of last season stuck with it and they have joined joined forces and uh, was it okay, six, okay. six temps between the top ten? That's a good be sign. Before we go Probably. into the final run. So be... That's that's a good sign. I don't know. Probably for the upcoming qualifying sessions it'll be more rest of the season that's looking good if we're gonna have qualifying that's this close always and it's also something to look forward to it is yes, something too. close together we're gonna see a lot of action and some battles going on which is always fun to watch it will be fun to watch uh i think max just popped himself into fifth so that makes it interesting and, uh, um yeah he did and he's there's fifth a... out but there's still others who need to make their runs. So mm -hmm. He's not out. He's not of the hook yet. We'd like to go with uh, Saiyan. See where he's getting. He's currently 
two temps already up through oh no that was his last lap so he's currently half a temp up through sector one mm -hmm. yep um, that's received here and uh, coming up to I think the trickiest braking zone on the, on the calendar well not on the calendar of this circuit it's one of the trickiest yeah, braking points definitely, on the calendar definitely. I think there's oof, that back end sliding there Back end is sliding indeed. Um, no, definitely the worst part of the track, but I mean, that it's. I think there's worse on the calendar. And then he's just going to bail out the steps, that's not particularly very good. Red mask is ahead. With plus one. That's not good. It's not improving by the looks of it. I will explain the tier situation for people that are not clued up with it, not in just our community but also other you know, people, new viewers in a second if you've been watching us for a while. There's been a few changes, uh, Ami's gone into second place. still first, he's No, but uh, two spell will make a decent attempt, I think three attempts uh, up on his time. Puts That's himself... Third. On to the second row indeed. Just waiting for you to watch it so you can see it yourself, Shane. <laughs> Shane. Shane is unfortunately not in the session, but having to use the stream, but glad to have another voice. It's better than, it's better than nothing. It is. We'll, work, we'll work out for next week. It's, it can't go... Oh, there was some contact between Ahas and... Oh. What How for there? a Mayo? That what happened there. That was very strange. Uh, who oh Red Mask has dropped it, that's his qualifying over. I'm looking towards Steve Oof. now. Steve he is actually finishing his lap. He's gonna finish that uh marginal improvement to eighth place. Anyone else? How is the Tim Man going on? No, he's not gonna do it. Orlando, our AM2 driver, is only fifteenth. Dan gets himself into 14th. So we also have Tichi jumps up to 6th. Tichi jumped up to 6th and that concludes qualifying and yes, pretty much. to be honest I'd like to see that there is one second between uh, pole and 16th. Less than a second. <laughs> that's, that's amazing. I think that's what we're hoping to bring this season. Tiers that are very close. EU2 I think. I'm trying to hype that one up because mm -hmm. I'm, I'm in it with a lot of other people but yeah, 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 that's yeah, looking yeah. to be very very close if it's anything to go by last season because um, no Jamie James, Jamie James is only available for the first four races, he is going to oh, reserve in EU2 and E1 just so he can race which is fair enough mm -hmm. but that is it, He won't, so he won't be competing for the championship so the long term who knows it's, it's going to be chance. very very, yeah exactly very very exciting. Qualifying. Uh, Jerry grabs the first pole of the season, and not by much, half attempt to Ami. Uh, Two spell gets himself in there in third. Sigate fourth, Red Mars fifth, Titchy sixth, uh, Max seventh, Jerry in eighth, Steve ninth, Irishman twin Jean also in tenth, uh, Tynus eleventh, uh, Cornish Mantis is twelfth, uh, Timan thirteenth, Dan fourteenth, uh, Frag, uh, Frag Nista, uh 15th, Orlando 16th, Twitch Storms 17th, but didn't really set a respective uh, competitive time. Uh, Spud didn't qualify and Tivo didn't set a time. Now, quickly before we uh, go into the race, uh, this is how it's going to work. Uh, EU3 is currently now on a Monday instead of EU4. Don't worry, well, I mean, though. There is no EU4. There's no EU4, but we've replaced that with something else. Uh, AM3. Is on a Tuesday, I believe. Uh, there's also now Crossplay. Crossplay is hosting its first season. The guys think it's good enough to go. Uh, we've got Crossplay on Tuesday and also on Friday, from what I've been told. Damn, Crossplay, the crowd goes wild. Whoa. Oh, whoa. Uh, we've waited and waited and waited, and I think it's now just about good enough after some trial periods in the off season, which you may have kept on Twitch. Uh, EU2 is on Wednesday as normal. Uh, EU1 is also on Thursday as normal. Both tiers looking strong. Some people aren't happy where they are. Some people are. <laughs> and but 
not much we could do about that. Um, but no, it should be very exciting at AM2 and also AM1 as well back. So three AM tiers, three EU tiers, cross play. Uh, we've got NASCAR and uh, a set of Corsa and GT7 is trying to get off the ground. So there is plenty of other stuff going on other than the loss of the EU4. Chain, yeah, are you one? Are you one stopping or two stopping? What What are you doing as your strategy? Come on, you're, on, you're a decisive I don't know. man. I um, I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if there's a safety car. So I'd guess a two stop might work. At least that's what I remember from last season where I got I th I what I did the one stop and then I uh, I lost out. Well, so I lost out because uh, someone just completely died from the whole thing. Let's not get into that again. No, there was <coughs> mentions of that, and I said, and I played the Michael Scott gift from the office of God, please no. And hopefully Cornish Mantis doesn't do what he said he was going to do. Um, AJ, no assist, sorry, no assist crossplay tier is on a Friday. That should be interesting, really. Who knows? Um, and they are a little bit earlier than the normal EU times. Um, strategy, as you can probably see on your screen now, there is uh, yeah. lots of different of people. Difference. Yeah, <laughs> I see. Everyone's picking their own poison. I see all three compounds being used. Although, yeah. all the three people in softs, mm. this two spell Tichy and uh, Dan. The, uh, the hard strategy, I feel, is always a risk, especially... Um, I was going to say yeah, it. Uh, yeah, well, especially as uh, there could be an early incident as we're in our first race and people will forget to know each other. Oh, yeah, that could be, definitely. Um, so, uh, to be honest, when I race on Wednesday, I'm probably going to look for a safe strategy and get myself around the 29 laps and hope for the best. That is it. Um, especially as uh, apparently is big, there's some rain about Wednesday, apparently, which oh. means EU2 okay. and, AM, and AM1 could have rain. Great. Fantastic. Why not? Always fun. In the desert. Mm. <laughs> yeah, right. Right. Any predictions, or you just enjoy the ride? I mean, it's it's the first race of the season, so uh, it's it's pretty hard to do predictions. But maybe next week. Maybe next week. Well, one, two, three, four, five lights. We see the revs build at the bottom. Lights out, and away we go. We're off to start season eleven in EU three, and it's a decent start. Oh, is an Alpine that spark? The Alpine, yeah. Good thing it's ghosted. Yeah. Uh, two spells. Did he take no. I have no idea, but two spell and J Ray are fighting for the lead. Two spells through on the soft tire. What a surprise! And we have the yellow flag. Is that a VSC? Ah, oh, it's it's the first it's one of the car. year, and it's hey. happened after 300 meters. Aren't you glad to be back? Yes, of course. And am I glad I am not driving this season? Oh. God, I hate this game. Well, this was the other thing about obviously going from E4, uh, two four tiers into three tiers. Is, mm -hmm. in all fairness, people like yourself and people like us have been like a bit fed up with the game just being the word I'm looking for, inconsistent at times. Especially inconsistent. That's so um, And it's not, and, it, and it's kind of thrown. A few people off. I know. I know you're not racing. We haven't had the likes of no create magician as well. Marina Rat's not going to be driving this year, but he's this season. But he's got other stuff to do with QRT, which is fair enough. But we've got him. We've secured the deal for commentary, so we have him on a on a Wednesday, which is fantastic. Um, these people just sort of like, we saw sort of Stumpy yeah. and we saw Stumpy give it up, not give up, retire. Titchy's back though, we managed to drag him from his short retirement. Um, 
but at least we've had some good news as well. We have some good news. It's, just, it's not just us, it's also, uh, also other, you know, other leagues well, I mean, current, currently doing the same. Yeah. Absolute job. Just about. You like to hang in there. I, I, I wouldn't call it driving at times, but no, going... Yeah, just, just about hanging in there. Just about hanging in there, yeah. Can't, can't wait to support the E1 Williams crew on a, on a Thursday, if required. Hall of E1? Yeah. Wait, I'm in EU2. I can't, no, I'm in EU2, but I can. I reserve oh. in EU1 a few I, for, okay. for that tier last year. Yeah, fair enough, fair enough. Just about hanging on to dear life whilst I watch Fruit and Troy just go round and round and lap me. It's like, oh, cool. Yeah, yeah you guys are good. <laughs> Why not? Uh, Oh, I might as well do it now, now so whilst I mentioned commentary. Uh, yeah. For the European tiers, shall I? Uh, on a Monday, you have myself and Shane. Thank you, Shane. That is correct. Stepping in. I, I, well, I wish it would have been in hope, different circumstances, but... <laughs> yeah. Well, hope, well, hopefully you'll be better than my partner that is currently racing. But he's up in the level, so that's very, very fun. Yeah, he's uh, doing you, good. You've got... Only yeah, you've got an interesting combination on a Wednesday. You've got Marina Rack joined by Donny. That should be live wire action. Uh, and then and then Thursdays, don't worry. We have the reliable duo and ever present. We have uh, Thomas and Racer slash Lewis on a Thursday commentating over the creme de la creme tier in terms of the European side of things. Should be exciting. Marine out doing his full punch. So yeah, that's all the things happening behind the scenes. It's been a bit chaotic. Shane, not gonna lie. It's it's been a journey to get this season on the way. It's, it's yeah. Been, it's, uh, it hasn't been easy. No, the, the timing of it all wasn't particularly uh, when we left the last season, we left ourselves left ourselves about five, six weeks of and we can't we can't really do anything for those five, six weeks, I mean. Yeah, great. So, it's awkward. Um, yeah, a little bit of struggles to uh, get this season the way I think we would have liked to start a couple of weeks before. Right? Yeah, sure. probably last week would have been ideal. Yeah, a, exactly. A week after the, but it's due to uh, changing of lineups and things yeah. that are ever changing. It's made us just hold it a little bit. But, had to come to a conclusion and decide to delay yes, the start but of the season. But we're now ready to go. Things, we are here. We are right here. Now. I said to the ladies and gentlemen, we've got 18 races to look forward to, but there's breaks in between, so don't feel stressed. Six weeks and a break, six weeks and a break, and then another six weeks. So we put some break weeks in, because I think it's in there. And that should... Hopefully, bring us up to the new game, which uh, I would like to say I hope it will be better, but it's EA doing it. And if they make anything like FIFA, it's going to be stinky. Mm -hmm. You think that's, so? That's my shots fired for the okay, evening. Okay, yeah, well done. At least uh, only uh, our community isn't big enough for EA to hear us, so. Yep, that's, exactly. That's why I can get away with it. Exactly. And that's also why they don't do anything about it. If we get Yarno to moan at them. Oh. Yeah, yeah, definitely, definitely, definitely. I'll, I'll talk to you in the chat. Yeah. Good yeah. friend of mine. <laughs> a couple of collisions, by the way, further down. Which saw time to make up a five second penalty. Yes, uh, but that's all under safety guard. And he has we got. Been in... He's got damage. Oh. Now, this is the other fly in the ornament, people. Uh, Tass, because it's cross. Task because of crossplay and EA, uh, Tio has not been able to get it up and running at the moment, so we are doing it out. So yep. you've got the old school visual looking on a screen. That's what I always so used. Good luck. When there was this. Yeah, exactly, but I don't <laughs> want to upset people. Um, uh, lights out, and away we go again! Oh, and. He's taking a good shot. He did. he did take it very slow, but I think, Shane, you'll agree, he's got himself a nice, decent gap as he runs down to turn one. Oh yeah, definitely. I'm watching now that I do have a yeah. the, the gap looks the gap looks stable and 
should be good for this lap at least. Also, he is on the softs. Yeah, so, when, when do these softs start to degrade you? Because we're on three laps right now. So uh, should seven. seven. I, re I remember doing like eight or nine as a last stint last year when there was a safety car that came out. We saw Twin Gene get past uh, all Twitch Storms in round. And that was uh, a coming together, I think, with Fragnista. Yeah. Ha on the Hass boys on the move, as I was saying, our most inexperienced pair in terms of contest and speed racing on the grid. And, uh, and Tynus is last by some distance, so I couldn't see that. He did pit to get the damage fixed. And he's had a spin on the cold hard tyres, that's not ideal. Uh, yep. Uh, Definitely, I speak out of experience. Um, it's, it happens more than We've that. all done it. Uh, Fragnista exactly. has spun at. Oof, well, he also. Blank, blank curve, we call it. And that is one of the OGs of a, of a driver that hated that Take corner. The curve. Whatever. I, like, there's, there's multiple reasons to spin. It's usually, in, it's usually inside on that corner. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's usually the, the curve. It's just, yeah, the game is it's so inconsistent. Just trying to get that feedback. Uh, twin but in the meantime, his teammate getting fifth place. Yeah, it's it's not uh, it's not over yet. This one. Uh, oh, it's like it's definitely going to come back at him. Picking the inside, but stays behind for this one. Uh, Wizard has checked out. He is currently 1.6 seconds in front, which is good because DRS is going to be enabled, I believe, uh, when they cross the line this time round. Uh, yeah, okay, it should. But Two oh, laps oh, after the safety car. Yeah, I believe. Normally, yeah, yeah. Should be, should be, but the wizard doesn't have to worry about that because he is more than second out in front. No. He'll be uh, cruising to the Oh, Jaren and Sidegate Jaren giving the old shoulder barge. Welcome, welcome. Back also goes through as well. That's easy position. Yeah, that's for him. what you get if you run wide. To be honest. Oh my word! Speaking of running wide, but also side by side, Spud and Tim Man have just gone through turns, I believe, 12 and 13 together. Wow, without splitting, that's without. Like, yes, very, that very well done, like, boys. Tim Man has to use the ERS to stay in front, and that's exactly what he did. Yeah. Was only about 20 percent. Jaren is behind. Fragnis uh, is spun. We will jump to Jaren, who is all over the back of the McLaren as he goes through past the McLaren using that flap in his rear wheel. There we go, yeah, DRS has been enabled and now uh, let's get some extra straight line speed in there. And, uh, Oh no, Spuds dropped it! Spud has dropped it. That's unfortunate. Mm -hmm. like the fact we have got stream elements updating people, I think. Oh, we have stream elements for this season. I know, it's in the chat. I know it's in the chat because it's popping up every other third message. Yeah, I uh, see and, I, it. and I have that in the and I have the messages on the corner screen where the track map is, so I can actually see what people are saying rather than looking all the way oh, down at my laptop. Yeah. I just I, j I just use my phone. I have you both, can... so I can see it's all working. Yeah, well, I mean, I have my uh, I have to watch the stream, but if I wouldn't, I'd still have it to sort of chat anyway. We have uh, Mac here on the back of the chat. He has got. I tell you what, the uh, Mercedes must be a bit of a put it in a straight line because uh, Max had to use DRS and ERS to try and overtake him. Yeah, that's and a last time. gets it done. But oh, that's one hell of a move. Definitely didn't get it for free. Uh, well, he's not got it for free because Jay Rins uh -oh. launched it down the inside. 
to turn four. These two are going to go side by side. This is very good. Uh, Max not giving up around yet. Racing. Though. Max looking for the switch back. He goes to the outside of where the hairpin is. You'll see that in a second. Switches back underneath. Oh, that was beautiful. Sign of things to come between these two. Oof, clean. But they're still side by side. Oh, uh, we've Mercedes just seen someone go in front of him. Uh, I think it's Ami. It is Ami. Oh, there he goes. Sends it into the barrier. You would have seen the stricken Williams head off. And that's no good because there goes points for the constructors. You know, my heart bleeds for Williams. And that's what I mm -hmm. and, uh, uh, Sucks to be you. Yeah, it sucks to be us at the moment, but that's fine. 18 races, plenty of time, plenty of time. Um, yes, definitely. And hopefully, twin, twin, <laughs> twin Gene needs to get on with this. He hasn't got much time because he needs to get past the hard run of Red Mask, who's going very strong, yeah. might I add, in this race. But he's closing in with the DRS. I think he's going to try and set him up into four, but it's not a good exit. Oh, there you go. You know, I just got a message from Frank Nister that my, he's using my setup and he says it sucks. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, you've seen Oh, the house contact, thing. probably. Yeah, they yeah. pirating, they've kept it together somehow. Jaren didn't go, Redmoss did, Redmoss, it's the commentator's curse for the first time this uh, season. No, they're both going, Redmoss solved the Mercedes jet of Jaren, keeps it on the track. Good driving from Saigate as well to uh, not yeah, plow into the now. back of the Mercedes. Uh, yeah, Spud, I think, just spun as well. Uh, chaos behind. Yes. Spud has also, double spun. Two seconds in front, he's chilling. Use chair. Uh, there's a train now behind the Mac. McLaren. The Mac train. All yes. the way down to 12th, by the way. So it's a, it's a hefty train, this one. Huge train. Uh, not anymore, because Orlando has just spun, and I think. Fingers crossed, he's not got front windows. So we'll go and check that quickly. No, he's all good. We'll go back to uh, this battle for four. But Joe Ren has. Run out. He's running out of battery. Spud has spun again. Um, I don't to state the obvious, but Spud, the tyres are overheating. Um, you need to not drive like really fast. Just, just saying. I'm trying to help. Yeah, it sounds. Yeah. Or, or, keep, or keep driving fast. It sounds, it sounds right. Like, that's what these cars do. They drive fast. Round of pit stops should be coming up fairly soon. Oh, shoot it now. Well, hopefully. Uh, the only reason why I say that is I think J Ray slightly holding the gap, if not closing in on well, it our was race. Well, it was 1.2.2 .2 last lap, so the gap's still steep. Shall I put it on timeout, shall I? Electric place. Time, time out the uh, stream elements. Uh -huh. uh, it is oh, yeah. all the, I think all it's doing is uh, promoting the YouTube channel. It's promotion. It's, it's, uh, that's yeah. fine. It's teething, teething problems. We'll get used to it. Uh, Spot to call, we'll come back on, out on track. So I think the gap is starting to come down. If it is. is. Jaron's just pumped Jaren. in his personal best. Uh, Twitch Storms has uh, gone. Fragments on the last. Point. Twitch I Storms has dropped there. it on the last corner, and we are in sa safety car mode. Hey, there we go again. Second one of the evening. Second one of the season. Great success. Also, this is perfect for the, the wizard. It is. He does now. He can now pit by uh, while using uh, while losing this time. That's what I'm 
just gonna... We do need some safety car topics, Death Storm, yes. Let's go to that yeah. time. Yeah, okay, so, so, um, come on, this thing, give, give us a talk. Well, they asked us about our American football picks for the Super Bowl, if you have any idea what that is. I, <laughs> I know what American football is, but I don't watch it. No, no, I no that's right. Well, at least you know what it is. Uh, yeah, Super I mean, Bowl I know predictions. What it is, but... I know what it is, but I've if, no clue. If you before. asked me before before my homies got injured, then I would have said the Chiefs, Kitten, if I'm being honest. But I now don't know. I can't remember who's still in it. I have no clue. I've never watched it. Uh, well, well, I mean, I have when it wasn't the Olympic Games. Shane, there is some action for us to commentate on. Oh, and you'll see, there and you'll is. see on your screen. Oh, Everyone is. is diving into the pits. The Mantis has stayed out. What a guy. What Honestly. A so is Titchy and hard. Steve. Um, yeah, no, everyone pitting was to be expected. Um, was it not? Uh, yeah, I think you're on the medium's not sure about it. I think that's a very awkward period to them. But. Uh, the wizard coming out on the mediums on lap 11. A lot of the guys have. Uh, well, a lot of guys come out on the mediums again, so that definitely needs some people will be pitting. There you go. Uh, Kittens asked you, come on. I have no, I have no idea what that is. I'm sorry to break it down. He's part of an esports guy. Wait, Valorant predictions? Damn. Um. You know, I, I'm still going to stick by my team. Um, I'm still going to go with Sentinels, even though I know they're not going to win. <laughs> but I'm a Sentinels fan, so let's fucking go. I was going to say, if, if you want to talk Valorant and Contest for Speed, then uh, the, the only person I know that does it as much as anyone else is probably you, to be honest. I'm probably the only one in the whole community. No, that's not true. I have had a message from... Um, oh, who was it? He asked me to play. Valorant. And then we played some games together. Me, him and a friend of his. Um, but I played very bad. I can't remember. It, it's it's one of the... It's, it's an admin. It is an admin because he has a good name. But I can't remember who it is. Uh... I think they will go to the end. Hards, they just asked the question, Hards, will they go to the end? I think they will. The Hards will, but I mean, the Wizard came out on the mediums, so the mediums on lap 11. Like, is he expecting another safety car to go to the softs again, or what's, what's the strategy? Well, we've had two so far, and we're only, what, we're only on lap 12. So, maybe he's banking on one more, I don't know. It's, it's not a the thing is, the, the thing is, it's, it's interesting because all those that came in, you look down, you look down the uh, that leaderboard, it's split. It's not not everyone's gone for the same. You've got two spells, Psygate, Tin Man, Red Mask, all on mediums. Then you've got J Ray, uh, Twin G, and Mac and Jaren and Tebow. They've all gone hearts, which is uh, yeah. Interesting, but then you've got guys that have not pitted yet, which is strange. Okay, so it is um, Nova. Nova, if one is here. Uh... He plays Valorant as well. Oh, we found him. We found the odd one out. Got him. <laughs> Just gets called out on the street. I'm looking for something. I can't find it. Here it is, position change. Uh, uh, let's have a look at position change. Uh, Corner Panic's up 11. Titchy 4. Steve 6. Good job to those guys. Amy down 13. And Red Mask down 8. Oh, the bigger losers. Uh, Tebow's also up 7 from the back of the grid. Two DNFs so far, Shane. Uh, Touchstones yep. and Spud. I think that's not bad, considering it could be a lot worse for the first race. No, definitely not. I mean, we've only had two safety cars. Okay, we are in lap 12, almost halfway through. 
Um, so I I wouldn't be surprised if there uh, I wouldn't be surprised if there's one more. Yeah. Uh, let's not hope for it. Well, the one on lap one was caused by I think by a spin and a touch of debris, but it wasn't like a proper crash. Spud uh, was a retirement on uh, in the pits, and Twitchstorms dropped out of the last corner, which is yes. kind of fair enough because that's always going to be a safety car for the where it is. So. I think everything's been kind of warranted. Titchy's gone into the pitch. You would have just seen that on your screen on the left-hand side. The Alpine He's diving, in, diving right in. So that's the delay that I have. Um, and X4270 is doing the same. So I'm slightly a bit confused why they've done it now and not earlier because they're gonna lose they've lost a lot of I mean track they're gonna position. be all the way at the back of the field. Even oh, yeah. even behind Fragmister's AI at this point. Which you can't overtake on the yellow flag. Uh, no. Um, I will remind you next time that he needs to <laughs> retire in the pits and not just leave the session because the AI is getting away because the game's not that clever. Um, yeah exactly. You know I just noticed that my kitten asks me about Valorant and then I see his message. <laughs> I didn't understand any of that, he says. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Hey, you asked the question, Shane gave you the answer. Sounds like yeah, a new what? problem. Yeah. Go get him, Matty. Get him. Get him, Tiger. Get him. Um, Hell yeah. You don't talk to Shane like that. <laughs> ho hopefully, the safety car will come in this that. Uh, uh, it should, the whole field has a corner. So. And the Titchy and Dan come out on the mediums, which is hmm, strange. So. Well, Dan is following his teammate. Uh, oh no, Dan did pit up. Yeah, that's uh, they it's, both pit onto mediums. So the thing is, that they waited that long, I thought they were going to hard. Yeah, yeah, definitely. That, that's what I would have thought as well. But the reason also went on the mediums. At the maybe, start of the season, maybe they've looked, at, they've looked at Steve, who's done ten laps on his medium, going, "Well, if I can, if he can make it that far, then I can try." And yeah. Make it that far. Speaking yeah. of Steve, that's what I wanted to point out earlier. Um, that Mercedes, he drove it last season in Bahrain, but last season Steve in Mercedes he was also a hell of a bullet in a straight line. Steve's Mercedes. Hmm. Well, the Mantis, I don't think know how many times he's done this, but he's about to uh, lead us away now. He's going to leave this really late, I think. But he's gone, but Steve's gone with him, more importantly. And I think Steve will get close to the And there could be a pass into turn one here. Steve to the inside, using the RS, gets the thing slowed down, runs the Aston Martin out of room, and up into the lead he goes Tim Mann has had a bit of a mare I think he's fallen back uh, and I believe the wizard also made a move as well uh, Jaren and J Ray oh that's, we've seen this before somewhere yeah. been here before we've been there on that I've seen Jaren Jaren does not like to give up does he oh, almost three wide in second if they go in to turn eight. Okay. Nine and ten. This is where because you're so close to each other you need to watch the car in front like an absolute hawk because some some people may break a little bit earlier than you do. Uh, Steve not been able to Steve not been able to pull away from the mantis. Which is interesting. Titus, I think, has just thrown it down the inside. Though he hasn't. Titus has spun. That's unfortunate. I oh, didn't get I all heard. of that because there was a pass that. Went, I'll say the has went round, but it's ghosted, so I'll shut up. Yeah, that's the, the fragments that left a long time ago. And that's his fault. Just oh. about when he spun. Uh, the wizard's just gone personal best through sector three and he's made the move on the mantis. We go on the fresh mediums, now it is the fresh mediums of the wizard against Steve's uh, 12 levels mediums. 
Uh, Bryn Mask has got past Mac. We're going to jump back out in front and we're seeing Jay Ren battling with McLaren once again. He will be disadvantaged though to uh, two guys behind him because he's on the tyre there the mediums. Uh, Mantis is trying to hold off Twin Gene who, well, if we think the Wizard's got to stop again, Twin Gene here could be provisional P1. There is a yellow oh, flag. Yeah, He's made the move stick, so now he's got to close up onto that the back of it. <coughs> he's got to catch the wizard chain, and I'm not going to lie, yeah. I think the, think the wizard's going to have his number for the, just this phase of the race, though. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely. Um, all I'm saying is that Twin Gene, he has to get within the DRS. If, he, if he's in there and he's if, uh, able to stay within one second, he should be fine. Um, that is, of course, if there's no safety car. If there is a safety car, then they're all a bit steep in the wizard. All this could be in. It's J Ray not giving up. They go shoulder to shoulder. Yeah. The McLaren jumps across the curb. Mantis, Mantis gets. Mantis not giving up. Oh, runs the, runs the uh, McLaren off the oh, track. Oh, big contact! Oh, they've got to be careful because they're nearly three wide. Oh, We've got a beautiful fine. helicopter shot of this. Oh. Six and cars. That for the McLaren. Oh. Jamie has taken damage there. Oh, big damage. Man, who's that? Red Masks has got Red Mask going to take advantage. Yeah. Oh, he Red Mask has got damage. Yeah, Red Mask, yeah. I oh. think there's a few more drivers there that's got damage. Sidegate got lucky to get away with this it. Is, this is chaos. The Balfatari got out of shape through by by the looks of things. Yeah, and yeah, then yeah. had a Definitely tank slapper. Got, yeah, and then got tapped uh, on the front wing by Aston Tapped one side, then tapped the other side. Um, yeah. But that all stemmed from the J-Ray. Uh, so I think, uh, yeah, Red must definitely have damage. Uh, J-Ray's got, J -Ray's J -Ray's got J -Ray damage. Has got, yeah, yeah, J-Ray, I saw the... I saw the uh, I saw the damage fall off yeah. the Yeah, that was the touch with JRN, which then yes. sort of dominoed effect the seven, like six cars behind them, all the way up to. Uh, sorry, I think it was a touch with Mantis. Maybe, sorry, maybe Mantis, yes. Sorry, Mantis, because Mantis is all the way back now in ninth. Definitely. Look at that, the wizard on the fastest lap, he's definitely going to he wants that first place. He does, uh, Tebow goes down the inside. Yeah. Red Mask pits, Jamie is going to continue with his damage. If he can stay within Psygate, then he's got a chance because Psygate will pit, but I think he's just. He needs to work with Mac here, I think. Yeah, I he think needs to let him go now, and he has. Well, that's exactly the way to say that. And yeah, there we go, not finding each other just now. Because what J Ray can do now is. During this tight hold up the guys behind. Yeah, especially yes. through this sector too. He can hold them up. Yeah. He's only really got this straight that's coming up now, but he's going to have DRS. He can hold them up through 12, 12 and 13. Uh, yeah, yeah, definitely, definitely. I mean, he holds back the cars behind, and then all Mac has to do is focus on the car in front and then pick his signal and clear behind. Which is a great team play. Because Mac can push for this. Well, notice through the race, although there's been a, a couple of mistakes, which granted it's going to happen bro. The pace yeah. itself, to, I think the pace itself is fairly even, has been fairly even. Yeah. It's been a close race, we've had the train uh, earlier on from was it, 6.50 to 12, so also it always nice to see that, people, that the drivers are close together and that's also a good sign for the rest of the season. It's a good sign for Mr. Mr. Wizard. Shane, uh, he has taken the lead from Steve. Steve gave him a lot of room there, didn't he? Fight here. Uh, and Red Mask has hit the wall and got no front wing. And and that's safety car three? or No, I think it's going to be a VSC, which everyone's gone past. It is. I don't know, I'm seeing the whole track. 
looks like you should see it. Yeah, there's no uh, no yellow dot to come out yet, so I think it should be no, a No, 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 that's what I was looking for as well. And we are green once again, so short VSC actually, which is quite nice. Allowed everyone to recharge the batteries and go again. Uh, we've got 11 laps to go. And we get to the line So, never say never, there's still a chance for safety. But at this point, mm. Twin Gene should be getting second from Steve, but the wizard is going to be. Dif more difficult as they're on the same amount of yeah. tires. Though the mediums will start to wear off near the end, I think, because he's, has been, he has been on from the lap of numbers. We've got, some, we've got still some spooky strategies out there. There's some people yes, are still not definitely. pitted. Uh, well, at this point, Twin Machine is in prime position. And the grid itself is very much half and half, half and mediums, half hards out there. Yeah. And we have Red Mask on the soft, I think that's a bit early, about 11. He's got nothing to lose. All we can do is ruin people's parties by uh, getting the fastest lap. <laughs> and taking away one point, which he won't get. Yeah, he won't get, so... He's not within the top ten, so he won't get it, but he can also can just prevent others from getting it. I so long. think the fastest lap point belongs to Dan at this point, who is also not inside the top ten, so... I will check for you. Doesn't change anything. Shane, absolutely spot on. <laughs> I, I pay attention, you know. Yes, pay attention. Uh, Dan currently in top on the fastest lap. Orlando making a move on J-Ray. That's what we like to see. Sorry, so battling with J-Ray still. You see it? Stupid didn't. You want a bit of real banging. And J-Ray should stay on the inside here. Uh, Steam Orlando, they're taking a sweeping line. We'll see in a second. Completely different to the guys in front. Yeah, he runs out wide, but I think. Um, oh, this is raising. extra speed, or. But this we can get point? him low. Better drive through turn 13. Oh, yeah, that's possible to do. Set him uh, up. There we go. And around the outside. And J Ray's going to dart into the pits. Uh, Steve's just been overtaken by Twin Gene, who is only a sec 1.2 seconds of our race leader. Let's jump up to 1.4 because they're still fighting. Steve says, No, I'm going to retain that position with the DRS open. Goes to the outside and gets that move done. The Mercedes doing a Ferrari the favour. I never think I would say that ever again. Yes, of course, the, the more these two keep fighting, the, the more the bigger the gap between the wishes going to be. Yep, three temps that has four temps that opened up. Twin Gene just made a small mistake and is now down seven temps. Yep. I think, I think he lost control of the car for a second, but he managed to save it. Although we're talking about these two fighting to try and stay with the leader, what it's done is Steve's actually doing his teammate a favour because at the moment he is yes. in four. Look at that in the chair and is now right on the back of Twin Gene. And just under three seconds off the lead. Now if the tyres go off as quick as they can do, Orlando spun. I don't know if that was contact with Titchy or not, because Titchy was got up to seventh, but I couldn't see it. Uh, but no damage, I don't think. I am switching back and forth. And Red so. Mask has in fact taken away Dan's point uh, because he is inside the top 10 now, Dan, but Red Mask has the fastest lap. He has stolen it. Uh, twin Gene, past Steam. Uh, JRN yes. is searching for it. It's not quite enough. Steve goes, gets pushed yeah, to Steve outside. Oh, others. horrible. Then the, he's going to just let his teammate go through. She's a smart and then just see if they can both attack this house. But also, this has allowed Sygate to uh, get himself in the mix here. He Pro does not have the DRS enabled at this point, but he's there. He's at the back within a second of Steve, so he will have the DRS next to him. Get into the stage. If the medium guys need to pit, they need to kind of pit now for the softs. Um, yes, I think the wizard's going to try. 
again, he the, does have a almost three second gap to him. The, the guys, the guy seeing Steve on eighteen up old mediums gives them hope to go to the end. This is what it's mm -hmm. doing. Um, yeah, 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 I mean, Steve. There's no way Steve makes it. Well, Steve currently. Let's have a look. I think he's nursing these tires down. Let's have a look at his split. So he's currently, he's only, I think he's one point. Well, he's 1.4 seconds off his personal best at the moment. That's, that's a bit much. How much are you willing to sacrifice to not pit? I mean, if a safety car comes out and he gets on the softs in EP4, he has made the second place. Well, Steve is Maybe coming in, so that's going to write everything off. No you said no gamble indeed. What's the twin gene can do? He's a uh, for the record, don't gamble, gamble is bad. Very responsible. You'll get <laughs> yep. plus 18 plus. 18 plus. <laughs> 21 plus in the end. Yes. Always oh, uh, you get in trouble with Yeah, yeah, Twi yeah definitely. With Twitch. Yeah. yeah. Although you said uh, who's, who's going to pick up on it. Uh, J Ray has retired. Has he? Well, that's on the track, and I'm not oh, yep. overly yep, impressed with that. Oh, wait, on the, tra and it's on the track. And there's Steve. Steve. One more lap. We're going to see and Fred Nice. Duh. All Steve needed was one was to hold on for one more uh, lap, and he would have had P4. J Ray's kind of saved ish. Uh, depends. That should be interesting. His car was facing the other way around. So it could be a bug with the bits or am I wrong? I have no idea, but the message that he's just written, uh, they confirm that. And I will do my digging and find out. Oh, in the Discord, you mean? Yep. Okay. I only have to Twitch channel this time. Oh, I shall do my digging. Uh, so the wizard stays out. Wow, okay. Uh, Twin Gene stays out. Side gets that. JRN comes in, but he comes in for, for mediums. Oh? Exactly. Oh? I've not heard that Belgian expression sound effect for a long time. Uh, Mac <laughs> does what we expect them to do and go on the softs, and he has done that, Shane. So. Yes, exactly. So Mac should now have the upper hand on JRN and. Most of the guys ahead, he does have. Well, I mean, unless he, unless he used all his softs during qualifying. Again, no. Oh, but I mean, during qualifying, what, what do you do during qualifying? Maybe one, two laps. So like, you, you can still. Use the worst they're gonna be is ten percent. But even then, a ten percent soft is probably better than a. Oh, I don't then know. yeah, exactly because this, all the guys behind him are now on the softs, and he should be. I mean, his mediums are fresh, they're on, they're on zero laps, so he's, so he's going to be able to hold off. But... The safety car will be out for this lap and next lap, so that's going to be what? Definitely 23, next lap 24. So maybe. that leaves us with five to go. The soft can do yeah, five laps. Five or four to go, I don't know, because we have with the uh, Fragmentus AI, and the Nos cannot overtake the AIs. As AIs don't drive too fast. But I think we might see next lap here. Very bad. With a bit of luck, we'll see it coming next lap. So, we've had the guys at the front actually not pitting. We have the wizard uh, Twitch Gene. Twitch Gene, I said, I told you he was going to be in a great position. Sigate there as well on the mediums. Tichi there, fresher mediums, two laps. That's Dan okay. behind, ten lap mediums. Then Ami or whoever it is, um, 50 level hearts. He's there, and I think. Um, if I if I where. think if I think I'll get this right, Ami is. When is Skeffish? May have got that one, or it's Tynus. It's one of the two. The relation to another driver in the, in the league. That's all I know. Um, oh, but. Sad. There is, there is multiple of those, yeah. Um, 
Some people here have got themselves into a good position after having a quiet race. Yep, especially. Um, I think if we look at the front, especially Dan, very quiet race. Um, if we look at Saigate, Richie, Wizard, the guys who are uh, feeling the bonus bits right now, they are not. They have had Uh, I don't know, I can't remember how many sets of... AJ, I've not touched the game in... Probably two minutes. Done one thing since. I'm okay. sorry. I'll probably have to uh, touch the game at some point. Properly. Um, probably hours. within the next 22 hours. Well, I've got to Wednesday. I'll be I'll be rooting for you. Thank you. Well, I'll be rooting for you in my in my mind while I'm playing Valorant. You go for it. <laughs> so once again, we see a lovely rainbow tire graphic on our screen. Medium starts and the softs all being used. Some very <laughs> interesting strategies. I don't, I don't know if you've seen the ch uh, this chat, but someone says uh, we need those strats. So yeah, pretty much. I saw that. They <laughs> From BK. Spot on. Spot on. Safety car might hold out for another lap as I expected uh, because yeah, Red Mask is not there yet. So we're going to have four laps to race. I tell you what, there's a few guys out. This this could get ugly, folks. There's a couple of guys out of sync here uh, compared oh. to it. Well, we've got Jaron. In seventh for medium, Steve was near the front. We got Mac on yeah, softs, Steve on softs. Yeah, all the uh, guys behind Jaren are on softs, so Jaren's gonna have uh, all the work to do. We're looking at softs, medium, so we're, he's gonna be able to hold off. I think mm -hmm. once they get past Jaren, the guys ahead of there are all uh, on older tires, so that should be less of a problem. And he's on 17 up on hard, you got guys on 14 yes. up on mediums. Red Mask has got a brand set. Of Brand new set of softs on, we know how quick he can be, he's not had to be, uh, not put the race together this evening, so it, it, it could get ugly. So if I'd have to make a prediction right now, I think Twitch Gene might win this race. Um, also, I think the guys on the softs are going to be able to get some places, depending on how fast they get past J. Ren on these fresh mediums, because he's not going to give up without a fight. But once they get past J. Ren, as I've stated before, the guys ahead of you on the tires are Big of a problem. Jaren's gonna be the biggest problem. Who actually the softs, which is a weird call. I'm I'm gonna go with. Uh, there's gonna be 12 finishers, and Wizard is still gonna somehow finish ahead of Gene. But I don't think either of them will win the race. That'd be quite funny. Oh, it's juicy. juicy. Mr. Guy has got a five-second time penalty for. Uh, Ooh. Corner cut him. Uh, there has been some penalties, BK. There's been one person with a track limit penalty, and that was J-Ray. That was it. And we've had Tynus uh, and... No, we've seen with track limits. We've seen just... We've seen Jet Dan just for track limits. Yeah, oh, sorry. Yes, five seconds for corner cutting because he's a cheating... Yeah. That's your... And that's your fault, AJ. That's your commentator's so curse. Of, so instead of... Um, Three seconds, you get five during a safety car. No, it's a five seconds. No, it's five seconds for corner cutting. Huh? It's five seconds for corner cutting and gaining the place. Oh, good. and gaining the place, okay. Yes. Um, but you're not allowed to overtake him. So. Sh I reckon he's. Uh, I broke him. <laughs> yep, this game. But I mean, we are off game. and we are going and Tuso yes. is under the cosh straight away. Let's go. He pulls as far as he can to the right hand side up against the pit wall. He's then going to try and squeeze the Haas out of room whilst Gene goes around the outside. He's going to block him off again. Yeah, Haas goes down. underneath. He's got it covered. I think there's crashes like I expected there would be. Max down last. Close to each other. But like Tynus is in trouble as well. Tynus is off in the gravel trap with Red Mask. Somewhere. Jaren has moved up two positions. He got Tichi and Dan. Jaren's got to try and prove us wrong. We said he needed to be on the softs. He's on the mediums. 
Um, Dan and Titchy are going at it. Now, this is a rivalry we haven't seen for a very long time, and it's exciting yeah, to watch once again. But they have the soft drives behind them, so... They have yeah. a small gap, though, nine-tenths to Steve, so... It's not all bad. Sidegate pulling out to one side, having to defend. For me, that was a bit of fresh air because the Mercedes is approaching with much speed and grip. Jiren is going to get third place, is he? On the call with the mediums, not the softs. If he gets himself on the podium, then we can ask that question and he can prove up yep. and tell us how wrong we were. Um, exactly. I mean, he, if he does, he's literally showed us how wrong we were. No DRS, so next time round we will have DRS and that will leave us with two laps to go. A nice little sprint finish here for the season yes. opener. Just for oh, Amy that. runs deep. That was close. Coming into the corner with way too much speed. Yeah, Dan's got past Titchy. Oh. oh, they go again. That, but that battle isn't over yet, Dan and Titchy. They're, no, they're not, not done yet. Shane? Yes, tell me. What are the soft guys doing? Um, I have no clue, but they're very, very much struggling to keep up with teaching them, uh, which, is, which I find very weird, as we now see uh, Steve here um, on the corner entry uh, getting close. And he gained a little bit on the corner, but it's not enough. I think maybe, maybe Steve might have a chance at the last lap to get one of them. But I think everyone's everyone behind Steve as in T1 Uters they're they're not up for a chance to no. get past Uters. Steve maybe a little small chance if he gets there. Well let's at quickly have point. a look then at uh ERS uh Ami thirty percent JRN down to fifteen thirty five for Sigate twin Jim twenty two spell thirty five it's all getting very close. These guys look to be the top five as they streak away from Dan and Titchy in 6th and 7th. Uh, Dan though struggling with his ERS and we're seeing a lot of movement further behind. Mac has retired in the pit. I probably would have done that because we've still got two laps to go and I reckon there's still going to be a couple more incidents. Um, yeah, so Jalen burned a lot of his ERS which has him um, not in the best position right now. He does have DRS, but I don't know. He has two laps left. He, if he wants that podium, he has to do it and quick. And, uh, the wizard doing very great at holding off to G, uh, a twin gene. Uh, well, I mean, he's on the medium. Oh no, Abby's, Abby's run deep and he's run wide. Damn. He's, I think he's gone to the curb on the outside. He's lost three positions. Lost it to Dan, Titch and Steve. Oh, he's going to be kicking himself for that one. Devastated. He's devastated. He's going to find it really difficult now on those hards to try and oh, gain also, those positions been, back. We've been talking about getting past these people, but in fact, Dan is stuck with that penalty. Dan so he's going to drop down. He's, it, he's on five seconds, mm. so I think he's, I think he's going to drop to tenth. I think... Before he'll probably contest it uh, all the guys in the top four then have DRS JRN's the one that got a little bit closer, a nice run out of the last corner, Sygate is struggling Twin G meanwhile goes to the outside Shane, it's two spell, two experience just runs him out of room again the, the newcomer's going to not on the ERS not enough mm. ERS to, to get this no. done it's, it's going to be fourth I'm telling you, the newcomer's yeah going to have to learn the hard way against the experienced head of uh, yes, two exactly. spell uh, yeah. Jaren dodges lift away on that to try and get past Sygate oh, oh he's pushing him through the corner yeah, they touch gonna lunge. Oh, he's going to lunge it he's going to lunge it the gap was open he's touching him he's, he's touching the back the door was left ajar he's going to try and hang it round the oh, he's down inside side. He's got oh, DRS. This is the last lap. He knows it's now or never. Sygate's got no DRS. Jaren has. This could be interesting. They're going to go to the wide, to the line. Jaren to the outside. Sygate goes. Have DRS. 
He goes round the outside. He's got it done for the second bit. Does the this is it. He's got it done for the second bit. Oh, and the crowd goes wild. And the crowd goes wild. Jaren, heart rate will be absolutely pumping through the roof to get that done. Orlando, oh, Orlando's lost a point. He Gets spun on the on last the corner. Last lap, third sector. However, it is going to be Two Spell Wizard who's going to take the win, the first win of the season. The opening round goes to the Ferrari man. Twin Gene on debut goes second. Jerome with that fantastic move seems off the podium. Sygate fourth. Unlucky to lose it that way. And Titchy in fifth place. The soft guys. Shane, absolutely nowhere. No, I, yeah, I know. And as I said, uh, Dan dropping down to 10th. Exactly as I said, oh, I'm good at predicting. Um, obviously, good at well done from the wizard. <laughs> good at maths, yeah. You know, if the world would know, uh, no, the wizard done very well. It turns out he made the right strategy call. I really thought Twi uh, Twin Gene uh, would have uh, been able to uh, get him as he was on the hearts, and the mediums would be uh, going off like right 19 laps. So. He made it work, and close to that. Well, I'm sure that's given a lot of the other drivers that are racing this week food for thought and how they want to do their strategy. I we didn't go think and go and test some different strategies and see what works the best for you. Because our race winner has just done a soft medium. Oh, I didn't yes. think that was going to happen. I'll be no. commentating on that. <laughs> that's one hell of a surprise. Mm -hmm. um, Shane, I think that was a very, very good first race of the season. First yes, race I, of the yes, it is. I would, I would agree with that as well. That, um, yes, I really enjoyed it. Even though I would have been uh, much more being in the lobby myself and have a look around than having to watch the stream. But here, and it makes my life slightly easier. Hopefully, next week we'll. Uh, We'll brush up and we'll find out. Sort out the issues. Actually. Yeah, sort out the issue, but that's fine. Uh, Wizard then wins the Bahrain Grand Prix by just under a second to Twin Gene on debut. Uh, Jaren, a third with that fantastic pass on the last lap. I'm sure his heart rate's probably going Giving through it all the roof. Got, yes. Because he had no ERS left. Uh, Saigate, unfortunately, then drops into P4. Uh, Titchy, fifth. He'll be pleased with that. Steve, sixth. Back racing and backed in the points team by seven. Ami lost some places right at the end. That's a little bit of heartbreak there. Eighth, uh, Cornish Man, ninth down with his penalty moves down to tenth provisionally. Orlando just drops out of the points on the last lap. Uh, Fragnus's AI somehow finishes 12th. Uh, Ties 13th, 10th, 14th, Red Mask 15th. Uh, Matt retired just before the end. J Ray retired on the pit straight. Twitch Storms retired at the last corner and Spud. Retired in the pits with rear wing damage. The people are joining. I didn't yes, even have to. I did, didn't need. To, didn't need to ask him. He was already doing it. Of course, I don't have anything better to do. I have watching the stream. Well, uh, um. Well, I can start off with him because he's here. Mr. JRN. How, first of all, how is your heart rate? After, is, is, it, is it through the roof after that? Because oh, yes. that was a fantastic, oh, not bad. It's just, oh, yes, it's calm, it's calm down a little bit. Um, because your heart rate must have been through the roof because that was a fantastic piece of driving and a fabulous overtake. How are you feeling? <laughs> so. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> well, a fabulous overtake, and perhaps pitting onto the wrong tyres was a blessing in disguise because all the soft runners behind you struggled to uh, pass everyone else. Maybe it was. Um, congratulations, mate. Podium. Good Good start. Good start. Well, yeah, hopefully good things to come. Well done, mate. Congratulations. Um, Twin Gene. Hello, hello. How are you? How are you? All good. Can you just make sure that your audio is set to be shared? Because I don't know yep. what it's like. Always shared, buddy. Always shared. Perfect start. Uh, there's no way I was saying this, but congratulations, P2 on debut. That's a that's that's a great start, isn't it? Yeah, honestly, I <laughs> I uh, I had a bit of a hectic day today, so I wasn't really. I totally forgot <laughs> that the race was going on, and then I saw that the uh, the twenty minute <laughs> the twenty minute thing came up, and I was like, oh. Well, I even race say like I literally been through some like today has just been like mad. So I was like, well, I even race, and I was like, ah, why not? Like, like what? What's the worst that can happen, you know? And then I was like, as soon as we crossed the line at the finish, I was like, maybe just a bit more practice. I could have gotten a wizard at the end, but oh, it was a it was a mad one. I was. Yeah, nice to probably get uh, the first one out of the way and kept it. I think. From what I've seen, red relatively clean as well, which I think put you in good stead for the for the last safety car. I mean, did you fancy your chances up against the mediums? Because we all thought the mediums were going to fade away towards the end. Yeah. I was thinking the same as well. Um, I think I throughout the whole race I was having troubles with wear. I think I just had uh, the pressures just one click too high, so they were just wearing a bit. Uh, faster than usual but um, I feel like it was just mainly because I just didn't prepare in fairness um, I feel like if I had prepared just that little bit I would have been able to to, to kind of uh, stick it more to, to Wizard there but it was a, it was a great old battle uh, between between me and Wizard at the end there so it was, it was fun though Fantastic start that's all I'm going to say same as Jaren it's a it... Get a podium first race of the season. It's it's a good platform and hopefully sign of things to come. So uh, congratulations, my man. Thanks, for uh, No worries. Welcome to <laughs> the league. Uh, we will move on to the Mr. Wizard himself. Uh, he performs magic once again somehow with 18 lap old mediums. Uh, Two spell. How do you do these things? Well, I think I'm I'm engaged to my medium tyres now after the the love and attention I've been giving them for. <laughs> Nearly 20 laps. <laughs> Full Sebastian Vettel of massaging the tyres, were you? Lovely. Definitely. I mean, did you feel, did you were you a bit concerned with them falling off the I didn't, cliff I didn't like towards the, last the safety end? Car. The, uh, even without the last safety car, I was going to make it to the end. It was like, well, that was fine. But obviously that was just sort of like racing my own race. So I had that sort of 2.8 second lead, which I was quite happy with. But as soon as I had to do some battling I started worrying in the last couple of laps mm. you kind of controlled it really you got the move done early on in the race and got yourself to the front and then tried to pull out the gap on the soft tyres we were a little bit surprised obviously there's yourself Dan and Titch on softs was that always part of the plan was basically was the soft it, medium part of the plan it was going to be soft medium medium um, but it was always the plan that if there was an early safety car that we would extend the softs and do soft medium because okay. under the safety car you can basically waste no 
um, wear. So obviously, because the safety car came out after turn one, I had like five percent wear at the start of the restart. So I was like, oh, I can push this to sort of lap ten or eleven. Um, I was gonna box the lap after the second safety car came out, but then the safety car came out, so I was like, right, I can make the mediums last to the end from here. But I did, uh, yeah, I wasn't enjoying having to do some racing at the end. So Twin Gene was uh, had a faster car in a straight line, and then I had the I had the grip um, in the low speed. So I was trying to sort of get away. But then whenever it was a a straight, he was just eating the eating the gap. <laughs> So I was like, you're not having the inside. Well, there was a, yes. All I'd say, that was experienced racing from yourself. I've seen over many seasons of pushing <laughs> the car out of the way and uh, leaving them to the outside and letting them know you're, you're in charge. But uh, yeah, <laughs> classic two-spell wizard racing, if I've ever seen it. Um, congratulations, mate. First one of the season. I Will know. there be many more? Hopefully. Can I ask that? I'll be, be missing next week because I'm away, but then I'll be back. Oh, this is shambolic. <laughs> Get him gone. <laughs> Get out of here. Get out of here. <laughs> well, hopefully more to come. Um, I'm sure we'll uh, we'll chat with you at some point. But well done to Glad our to podium people. Hopefully we'll be hearing from them throughout the season. That leaves us really that is really. Shane, thank you for being alongside me for the first time this yeah, season no hopefully we'll sort out the stuff for next week hopefully um, we'll get that we sorted should. we should we should we should be good um you're not robot shane anymore so everyone's probably happy that they nope. can hear you um nope. that leaves us with that then uh, am3 is the next on track racing that's in a few yes. hours that is 2 a.m uk which is 9 p.m eastern question mark i think Shit. i've got that right yeah, um I think so. All EU tiers and crossplay tiers will be doing exactly the same uh, calendar, unless I hear otherwise. Uh, then it will be crossplay tomorrow at AM2. Uh, EU2 on Wednesday with AM1, and then EU1 is on Thursday. Crossplay no assist is on Friday. Friday. I think I managed to get it all done and right, and hopefully the powers that be don't kill me now. So. Yes. If, if they haven't killed me, I'll see you guys next week. Uh, thank you very much for everyone that watched this evening, and good night. <laughs>